Zandio. <laughs> hey, we don't do that here. This video is gonna be all about our preparations for Burning Man. Hi, Lilu. Here's Lilu. She wants to say hi. Hi. Are you gonna miss me? Oh, oops. Sorry. Okay, so uh, I wanted to show you the tickets. So this is kind of the little package you get in the mail with the tickets. I just painted my nail, so I don't want it to get all of everything. This is my tester color, black with gold. This is the vehicle pass. And we have two tickets. This year, the theme is carnival, kind of circus. So they're really cool. They kind of shine when they hit the light. This is the Burning Man Survival Guide. It's the same thing every year. It just tells you about it, how to get there, what to bring, what not to bring. Here's kind of the layout. Uh, you can see the street numbers and then the street names. It starts with E and then it goes A through L. So last year we were at 745, which is this little street right here, and K, which is that one. So we were pretty much out on the outskirts right there, like right in the middle. It's quieter um, because you're on a quarter street and not a main street. It doesn't go all the way to the Esplanade, so there's less traffic. Um, this brown area is uh, reserved for theme camps. This camera doesn't have a very wide lens, so you'll probably you'll probably see my buff arm, ooh, in all the shots. But hey, so I also wanted to show you some of the food that we're gonna be bringing with us because you have to bring all your own food. So tonight I just made some pollo asada that we got from Costco. It was already marinated, so I just threw it on the grill. And this we're gonna share with everyone. This is really yummy coffee. Really good. We had it this morning. Um, so we can also bring cold items since we have a refrigerator this time. Some tri-tip from Costco that we're gonna put on the grill and then freeze it. And then we can just unfreeze it when we get there. Lots of uh, deli meat. We got um, a couple salads. So we got different kinds of cheese. This is one of my favorite cold brew coffees, so we're bringing some of those, and we're bringing a bunch of hard-boiled eggs. We're also going to go to the store, and we're still going to get yogurt and just, you know, normal stuff that you eat that we can put in the fridge. So this milk is um, shelf-stable until you open it, and then you have to put it in the fridge. But it saves a lot of space because we don't have to put it all in the fridge right now. We can just put it in the cupboards and put it in the fridge uh, when we want cold milk. A lot of the stuff is in the RV already, but there's still a few things that's out. I got some pretty cool makeup this time that I'm really excited about. Oh, and I got these really cool press-on tattoos. Oh, here's one of my messes. I'm choosing which colors to paint my nails and making a mess in the process because that's what I do. I make messes. So the house and the garage are a mess and one thing we have to do before we leave is clean it all because we're having house sitters here and it's just not nice to leave them with that mess. So this is the state of the garage right now. We washed the sheets for the RVs. So they just need to go on. We've got laundry that needs to be folded. Lots of laundry that needs to be folded. Ugh, this is just crap. Um, so this is one of the bikes that we're taking. It's Kenny's trike. It has this cool canopy on it. And it also lights up at night. Um, here's the passenger seat. So when you open it up, there's a big big wood box and it's also insulated so you can bring cold stuff in there. Uh, this is the back wheel so that it doesn't slip over. Oh, it's also electric. So you can pedal it and then when you need the pedal assist, here's the controls right here and it's a front hub uh, little motor. This is the rest the rest of the water bricks that need to go in. About 12.30 now, we're still working. 
we have all the puppies. There's Miss Jones. Hi, Miss Jones. Oh, look at her with hair. Oh, you're so pretty. And then there's Mr. Bear. Hi, Mr. Bear. There's the RV at night. Hi, nighttime RV. So right now we have one yurt for Tori and Noah, and the rest of the platform is going to be for the trike that's in the garage and probably my bike. And then up on the roof, there are two bikes. I can't really see from here, but there's two bikes up there, Tori and Noah's bikes. Where's Mr. Bobatron? Bobatron? Oh, you're scary. So pretty much everything in the RV is new. So when you first come in, you see this bubble wall. It was completely white and spray painted gold. And that's just electrical tape in there to give it some definition. And then the carpet is the same gray. And then we've also put in this wood. So in the front of the RV, we haven't done anything with the chairs yet. This is still the same. So you have the driver's side. Um, a new addition is this, is the backup camera. We have two cameras, so this displays them. And then this controls the radio and all kinds of other stuff. And there's a couple of speakers. And we're still figuring out what to do with that. And passenger side and uh, carpeted all this, which took a really long time. This chair is from Ikea, and it has some water bricks around it. There's also water bricks underneath this daybed couch thing that we kind of just put together. This is the kitchen area. So um, anything that you see white, like these cabinets, was painted white. It was wood beforehand. Um, and then this was all upholstered by Kenny. And we have a coffee machine that actually works. And a little mirror. Hi! And we have so much stuff shoved in. That's some of Tori and Noah's food. And then, oh, here's our TV. Right now it's not hooked up to anything like a phone, so nothing happens. But earlier we were watching YouTube videos on it. So we're bringing a bunch of coconut water that goes all the way to the back. And there's, <laughs> we really like these from Trader Joe's, obviously. And here's some snacks for the road. And uh, more food items. Here's our refrigerator. Uh, oh, it's cold in there. Ooh, cookies. And then our freezer is also working. We have some ice cream in there. Nice and cold. Microwave. And our little oven and stove. Here's our beautiful knife display rack with the tile behind it. This guy is going to go up there one day. So we have all of the silverware and accoutrement up in here and all kinds of kitchen stuff. Oh, hi! Hi, girl! Danny knows how to get up the stairs. Okay, making our way back into the bathroom area. Here is the sink. And we have lots of storage space in here. We're not even using most of it yet. But we still have a lot of stuff to put in. Here's me again. Hi. And this is pretty stocked. Full of anything and everything you'd need ever. So one thing we didn't get to do yet is paint this silver. It's still gold. Like the original color. But here's the shower. We have new shower head, of course, a little bath mat. And um, because we want to save as much water as possible, we're going to use this bucket for uh, when you're waiting for the shower to warm up. The cold water can go in there and then we can use it for something else. So here's a piece of art that is 
um, nailed to the door because that's how you do it in RVs. So this is the original carpet, this blue. And this was the one room that did not get done. I've been trying to find little um, containers. Ugh. So I got these containers from the 99 cent store and that there's like eight of them for a dollar. This is a pee pee funnel to use in the porta potties. So you don't actually have to sit down. So you figure that out. Here's another mirror. Oh, oh, oh. It's from Costco. So this is the shagadelic gray carpet with our gray bedding. When the blinds come down, you can just have it kind of blocking out some of the light. And then if you want it all the way dark, you pull down the gray and those are a blackout. They were not gray when the RV was purchased. That was also done. These lights were put in from Ikea. And so we've started putting in some of the clothes for Burning Man so far. I've kind of taken up this closet with uh, my costumes and here are my shoes. And I have a bunch of tutus in this box. And um, hats and goggles and gloves and shorts and tights. This is still open. It's a little mini closet. You've got your drawers. Um, these two I think are half full. Got some more drawers. And I've started putting some of Kenny's stuff in here. We switched out all the lights. They're super bright now. They were regular lights and now they're LED. So super bright. So these are all the batteries. That looks like something you'd use for a phone, but it's not. This is the solar charger. This is the solar charger. And this is the inverter that converts oh, the 12 inverter, volt, 12 not the volt converter. into uh, 110. So we can watch TV and so whatnot. We can watch TV and whatnot. And okay. run and run a hair dryer. No. Lilu, computer says. Good girl.